Subscribe and welcome to the content. Now I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Now, out of all the celebrities that I have heard of or know of, John Moran is unique. I won't lie, I have never seen someone who has consciously, purposely, deliberately tried to ruin his career like John Moran. Like, whether it be an, a, a super athlete or an actor or a musician, an artist, whoever it is, if you have a presence and you have a career and you have, you know, a life worth protecting, a reputation worth, you know, upholding so it can benefit you and the people that you care for, you try your hardest not to ruin it, but John Moran, I don't know what he's trying to do. Like you are well off, you play for a good, you know, uh, team NBA. I don't know. I just know that if you're in the NBA, you're doing well, you're doing, you know, great. If you're performing, you're gonna get your bag, and your reputation is obviously still, you know, at, at good, you know, at good, at good standards, at good standings, and it just seems that. You got such a privileged life. You are able to provide for the people you care for, your your community, your family, your friends, and so on and so forth. But you just consistently seem, you consist, you constantly just want to ruin that shit, bro. Like you are genuinely like, damn, I don't really care that I have all this, that I should be grateful for. I want to be a gangster. Like seriously, why is it? Why are you so desperate to be something you're not? Why are you so desperate to? To like I don't know have this type of persona so people can view you in this type of way like you some thug bro it's not necessary it's it's something you usually developed to survive in life you good you don't need no survival taxes like those ever bro just hire some security you'll be okay learn some self-defense you'll be right get a gun but don't freaking pull freaking show it on ig live like you are ruining yourself and you are ruining your reputation and the people around you who benefit from you you are also kind of ruining them so it's just like it's so crazy that for a person who's living such a good life in a, com in a comfortable situation you're just constantly looking for ways to ruin it don't you know that you're working for an organization which does not like that type of persona like other freaking superstars or artists who actually work under someone they know that they gotta stay in line they gotta do things right and obviously it's beneficial for them for them to be able to live the life or the career they are but you want to be some nba young boy want to be bro it's, it's it's so sad you know what i'm trying to say and some people are blaming his friends. They're saying, oh, they're the ones who are busy putting... Bro, we live in a digital age. We live in the social media age. Everything is Instagram, TikTok, Twitter. Like, that's the life we live, bro. Everything is on camera, on live. You, clips are everywhere. It's just... Especially when you're a freaking celebrity. It's just like your privacy is always going to be invaded. Whatever you do, everybody's got eyes on that, bro. And especially you, Jamaran. You are a very relevant in... It was this superstar right now. And you out here doing this shit. It's just like... You you are expected to know better. Like I get it, you're young, you're still 23, you know, in your early 20s and stuff, you're still figuring it out life. You, I, I can't be blaming you and everything. But it's like some things you need to have common sense for or maybe it's because the people who are, are supposed to be responsible for you are not, you know, guiding you. That could also be one of the reasons. I don't know what it is. I don't want to judge you, whoever is, you know, influencing you, whatever. All I'm saying is that you are in a road, you are on a road to ruin your life for, for nothing. But like, you don't need to be doing that. Like, genuinely, you don't need to. All you need to do is, is be throwing hoops. If you want to be a freaking gangster or rapper, you want to live that lifestyle, go into the booth, record a couple shit. I don't know, people buy it. But it's just like, you are, you're well off. You don't need to be doing none of this. You don't need to be acting all tough, this persona. Nobody cares, bro. People just want to see you hoop. That's it. Stop it. You look like a clown, bro. And it's not just for the people who are watching, for yourself. It's just like, do you not understand that you will ruin everything for nothing? <sighs> Other than that, man, God bless. Have a nice life. And I'll see you guys. Bye. <laughs>